next animator we got coming in the hot seat. She's absolutely amazing. She's a podcast called Stories with Sat uh, Sapphire. And she's also a paranormal expert on the Travel Channel, which, yeah, I mean, nice. I I gasped when she told me this. Fucking <laughs> <laughs> Dalla with her dog. Yeah. With her dog. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my god, yes. Oh, oh. Mike Kaplan, everybody. Mike Kaplan and Seth. Are here. <laughs> Good to be here. Thank you so much. Uh, so I want to say, I want to make a call back to some stuff that your last animator drew, but that's not how this show works. So let's get that other animator back here because I want to <laughs> talk about Captain Planet as well. Uh, just to say that if he was working out, how about Captain Planet Fitness? All right, it's worth it. Uh, <laughs> totally worth it. Cancel the whole planet. That's what's happening right now. Um, so that's, I don't know if that's me or Sapphire. I think it's both of us. But uh, <laughs> it's hard to know what is going on. Yeah, we're all one. <laughs> Do you know that yesterday scientists were saying that it's Friday? And today they're saying that it's Saturday. Make up your mind, scientists. Get with it. Make, what's tomorrow going to be? Bloom's Day? That's not even a thing. That's not a word. Come on. Like, animals don't use words, and they've been around for longer than scientists. So I'm going to trust <laughs> them over scientists. Like, you know, which came first, the chicken or the egg? Hey, which came first, the animal or the scientist? The animal. I'm listening to the animal. And maybe if you're an animal scientist, for example, my favorite, Niels Bohr. We're having a good time. There it is. Niels is a boar. Or what, 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 are the, what are some other ones we got? We got, uh, oh, uh, uh, Neil's uh, Snake in the Grass Tyson. And we got, uh, let's see, I wrote one down, Alexander Graham Bull. How about that one? We're doing great. Uh, pretty fun. Maybe maybe some others? No. Okay. Maybe there's some, uh, maybe not every scientist is an animal. Maybe there's some scientists that are mountains or rivers or stuff, but they their experiments take way too long for me to know anything about. That is a good Neil deGrasse. And I <laughs> I just want to be snakes coming out of his head also like medusa if that's possible i just want snakes coming out of every there we go that's right you do what i say because it's fun uh I'm, you do what you want to do but also if you if it's what i say then great okay let's uh continue joke over uh, i just want to talk about rock paper scissors real briefly and how that game doesn't make sense for this reason, my, my position there, looking like I don't know what's going on, is perfect. So rock <laughs> destroys scissors, of course. Scissors cut paper, absolutely. And then paper wins by covering rock? Like that doesn't, what? That rock <laughs> does not, that's not how you beat something, by covering it. That's actually like, I don't get defeated by my blanket every night when I go to bed. You understand? Like we are a team. That's actually how it works. Like cover me, I'm going in. That's because we're working together. Like maybe paper just has the best PR. Maybe they put out like, hey, look at me there. Oh, that's so sweet. Uh, it looks like, like, it's like a superhero. Like a blanket is like a reverse cape. Like I'm like a vampire who's awake. Okay. We're having a good time. And uh, look at that. Oh, wow. Oh, God. The, the superhero. I am sleep man, able to fall asleep at the drop of 10 hats. Okay, so, like, hey, what happens when your job goes the worst? Like, that's, you know, you, ever, you, ever, you meet a doctor, you're like, hey, what happens when patients die? Do you hate that? And uh, there was a woman at a show. A show was going great. This woman talked through everybody's set. Uh, it turned out she was drunk. After the show, she came up to me, and she was like, hey, I had to tell you. She didn't have to tell me. I had to tell you. You talk too fast. You talk too fast. And I am a scientist. I am a scientist. And all my friends, they also agree you talk too fast. And I, all her friends were behind her being like, uh, no, that's actually not true. And uh, they weren't saying it. But yeah, I've, ooh, look at all those. Those are all her friends. That's right. They're all scientists. They're the science animals. That's so beautiful. Oh, God, how did you do it? You're, you're a genius. Okay. Uh, sorry. I'm not, my set doesn't usually involve calling the other person drawing during it a genius. But that's what's happening. Uh, uh, so anyway, there's not usually a person. This is unprecedented. Look at that. She's so drunk. She's shaking. Okay. And so she says, you, we all agree. You talk too fast. I was like, well, uh, thank you for letting me know your feedback. What is your name? And she says, my 
name is Erica. I was like, thank you so much, Erica. I really appreciate it. And then I went away from her and I went outside. And three minutes later, she comes up to me again with her friends. They're on their way out. And she's like, hey, I just had to tell you that you talk too fast. And my friends all agree. And I'm a scientist. And I was like, well, thank you for telling me again, Erica. And she was like, how did you know my name? I wish that I had said to her, because I am a scientist. I just want to share with you uh, a game that I've been playing during these quarantine times. And you can play too. And the game is called Science Says. And here is how Science Says works. You might understand, like, if you learn about something that science says, then do it. Like, for example, if science says, wear a mask. Absolutely. I'll do that. Science says, uh, when you're going outside, stay six feet apart from people. Absolutely. Science says, I'll do that. And now drink bleach. And I will, blah, 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 blah. Science didn't say. Oh, my God.